From time to time, I see Smartsheet users wanting to know how to calculate the last day of the month based on a month and year. I've set up this example sheet and we have the month in text form with a three letter abbreviation. Then we have a column for the year. Then we have a column that calculates the date as the last day of the month based on the month in the drop down here and the year. Now to get started, we're gonna to need to use the date function. So um, we're going to first translate the month abbreviation into a number and that's done with some nested if statements you'll see there's a long chain here and all it says is if the month here is january then it's a one if it's a february then it's a two and then so on now for the date here to get the last day of the month and what this function does is creates the date on the first day of the month following the month that you want the last day for. And there's two cases. The case where uh, from January through November, we can simply just add one to the month number here in this column. And that'll give us a, the day of the following month. So if we're looking for the last day in January, for example, we would create the date of February 1st, 2024 in this case. Then we subtract one day from that, and it'll give us January 31st, 2024. Now in the case where you're trying to find the last day of December, since there's no 13th month, we count for that with this if statement by saying if the month at row is 12, then we add one to the year, and then we subtract that one day. So in the case where we have December 2023, we would actually create a date for January 1st, 2024, subtract one, and that'll give us the December 31st, 2023 date. There's more than one way to write this formula, but I'll go ahead, reference it down in the description, and I hope this is helpful.